All right, so now we're going to check out three class study in 980 square feet unit, and of course, Ken is going to show us the way. So in fact, there are a lot of three bedroom layouts down yep. here. Um, I would say that they all generally look the same. Mm. Um, the only variation that we have um, is the balcony or the entrance of the kitchen. So when you come down here, you look at this layout, you can visualize very clearly the other type of the three bedrooms. Okay. Right, so instead, just now I was mentioning about the, the small little touches that created yes. a better space for, for the EC. Yep. Um, so one part is here, they have provided even the smart di digital lock um, mm. on every unit. Okay. Um, and also, for most of the condos today, they don't provide, uh, they only provide an audio intercom. Right. In, in right. Tenet, they're actually giving a, giving a video audio intercom. What? For right. an EC? Yes, for an EC. So these are small little touches that brings up um, the, the entire value sure. of Tenet. And then we, we like how they have segregated the entire living area. Um, so that you don't combine your dining area together, you have a good um, isolation of your, your living. Yeah. Yet at the same time, the dining area is um, located over here. Sure. And conveniently, they have created a backsplash where you have access to um, your microwave oven yeah. um, and a space for your fridge. And, and again, the brands that they're using for the fittings are from Bosch, uh, which most of the ECs do not provide such, yes, for sure, such for sure. brand. Right. So let's see the kitchen. I like how the kitchen is, the space of the kitchen, and I think you'll like it too. So over here, the kitchen, um, we can see that it's a very nice L-shaped kitchen that is pretty rare in today's context. Mm. Um, very good space for uh, food preparation and cooking. Um, and then of course, they have small little touches over here uh, where they provided um, an, a bin for you to, to throw all your stuff actually. And then some little racks over here for you to place your... Oh yeah, your condiments. Yeah, your condiments Beautiful. and everything. So I think I, I really like how this, this kitchen looks and the functionality of it. Uh, they're providing actually a Bosch gas stove as well. Bosch again? Yeah. And, and if you come in here, you can also see that um, for all the three bedrooms, you have a very nice separation of where your yard area is, yep. where you can place your washer, dryer, stack on top, naturally ventilated, um, and you have a bomb shelter, home shelter on my right. So this bomb shelter can double up as a storage, yep. um, helpless, or a helpless room, room yep. and a WC that's convenient, conveniently located over here. Sure. So I like this space quite a bit. Yes, yeah, very nice it's tucked all the way inside. So let me show you another special uh, part that they've created. There's more! Outside. Okay, let's go. So we're here at the walkway. What's going on? What's so special? So you know usually for walkways, they are either very dark because yeah. you don't have natural light coming in. That's true. Uh, yeah. Or it is totally unusable, yeah. right? Walkways to a lot of buyers are a, a wastage of space. Yeah. Uh, but today they have created a very nice alcove along the walkway. Um, and for the three bedroom units, you can see that um, although we don't have natural light coming in yes. here, but you have a nice alcove that gives you an idea that you can create a study area for your kids in this area. Nice. So now you have a function to use along the walkway. You don't waste the space. Right. And they can be working here. And of course, the idea has created a very uh, brilliant idea. If your friends and families are coming along, or you no have to way. Just cover up this place. This is so cool. And it's back to like a normal walkway. Oh, this is one of a kind. I mean, yeah. I've really so seen it, this before. I really like this uh, small Yeah, it's beautiful. And, and we have this alcove um, almost in every unit, like I sure. mentioned, except for the four, some of the four plus study. Um, and in fact, for type C2 onwards, yep. you will be able to have your, your alcove is actually um, backed by a top to bottom um, glass. So window. you need to see you have a window. You, yes. you have natural light coming in? Yeah, natural light coming in. So your walkway will be bright. We can show you in the 4 plus study. Wow. Show you in So we're about to check out the 4 plus study, 1367 square feet and oh my goodness, the space. Ken, let's go. So we're going to look at the largest uh, yeah. 4 plus study unit in, in Tenet. 
Sure, so similarly, we have all your digital log, audio video panel, but what blows your mind away is actually the wide span of frontage that you have. This is nice. Right, so you actually have a living dining that spans across a total of 5.4 meters. Um, like we always mentioned, in yeah. the terrace is about 6 meter Six, frontage. Yeah. So this is as good as a landed living. Pretty right? much, yeah. And I think the ID has cleverly shifted the dining area into this area. Um, so that you get to enjoy a full 5.4 meter sure, space sure. of living area. You yeah. can easily fit in an L-shaped sofa to enjoy yeah. and host your guests. And conveniently, when your dining is here, you actually get a generous backsplash of cabinet trees over here. Um, your ovens and then you got enough space for a double panel fridge. Nice. So same as what we saw in the three bedroom, as you follow me into the kitchen. Also L-shaped? Yeah, we have an, again a very nice L-shaped -shape, L -L kitchen. Yeah. And then of course over here we have the dustbin and to make use of um, the hidden space, they have actually provided mechanism where you can put um, stuff inside so that you don't have to reach in. That's very smart yeah. and thoughtful at the same time. Small yeah. little touches that we have. Um, then again, of course, as we pan through, you can see the bomb shelter, the WC, uh, and the yard area all nicely tucked away. Sure. Is it very similar to the other yes. side? Yeah. Let's, let's show you the, um, the walkway with the, the natural light coming in. Ah, yeah, that's right. Here. Right, by the study, I suppose. Yes. Okay. So this is the part where, on traditional terms, this walkway is dark and not yeah. usable. So this time round, you can see that we have top to bottom um, glass finish. Sure. Uh, window that's accessible for wind to come in. So this walkway will nat become uh, naturally littered up and this again a very nice alcove for your study area. I this don't think you will do a storage in this because this yeah, is a very this nice This is alcove. so interesting. Yeah. With the natural light coming especially. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so in fact in the four bedrooms you can see a very generous size of a of a master bedroom spanning a, to spanning a total of 20.3 square meters. Oh wow. Very luxurious. So you can see that um, I can have a king size bed, I got enough space for a side table, I can even place a play area or yep. a baby yep. cot baby over cot. here. Yep. Right? Yet I have three panels of wardrobe and mm. again for all the toilets they are naturally ventilated. Now that we have come to almost the end of the video, we would like to thank Ken for that the fantastic introduction of Tenet. Now, Ken, I noticed there's an award here. What's going on? Yeah, so um, actually Tenet won the Best EC Development Award by Property Guru Asia Property Awards in 2022, um, even before it was launched. Right. So that speaks volume of the quality that they bring in, and this is just one of the many awards that the developers have won over the sure. years. Yep. Sure. Okay, now, next point. Let's talk a little bit more about pricing. Now, a lot of uh, people, of course, um, are expecting to sit on the same kind of profits that the previous EC um, owners have, have gotten, right? So, are we still able to see that kind of profit today? I would be daring enough to promise the same yeah. kind of profits, but I think uh, we will talk about it logically. Sure. Um, so, you know that um, the, the OCR prices, private residential, has been climbing at a very steep rate yeah. over the past two to three years because of the lack of supply. Mm -hmm. um, so, over the years, um, when we take a 10 years mark, um, the price difference between an EC and a private residential in OCR has always been at the average of about three to four hundred dollars in fact. Okay. Right? But because um, for ECs uh, being kept by MSR and the income ceiling yeah. of 16000 um, developers can't ramp their prices up too much in ECs. Sure. It's a bit more controlled. So as of today, we are still seeing a very big gap, a widening gap of now almost $590 to $600 per square foot difference mm -hmm. between the EC prices and the OCR private residential. And this difference will then be the capital appreciation that buyers can be looking out for right. when they buy into tenants. So this itself is an opportunity, right? Correct. 
Now that we've come to the end of our SRN New Home Showcase, just want to share with you that Tenet is going to be previewing on the 12th of November yeah. uh, for three weeks all the way to the 28th of November and booking day is on the 3rd of December. So right. these are the dates that you just need to kind of remember. Uh, so do contact any of our SRI salesperson if you want to come on by and check it out because this is your very last chance to get an EC with good capital appreciation before you go off for your holidays. Right. So yes, uh, that was it and we will see you guys next time. See you. Bye-bye.